What's up, everybody? I'm Sniggenhoff, and we are back once again playing EU4 as Bahrat. In the last episode, we declared war on Persia. We're going to take some land off of them, so that should be fun. And anything else going on? Anything else special? Punjabi separatists are thinking about doing stuff. But they may not even do stuff, so... Alright, so I'm going to release Afghanistan out of this war. Which means I need to take this stuff. Can I eat all of Persia? No, not quite. This would cause Persia, Tiberistan, and Sulu to join the coalition, who's not already in the coalition. Persia won't be anything. Tiberistan is a thing. Sulu shouldn't really matter. Yeah, I think that's going to be fine. And I'll just feed it all to Afghanistan. six years early. Won the Siege of Kandahar. Netherlands gains, gains uh, the end of religious turmoil. skill production efficiency guy. I don't want that. I want the prestige, I think. I don't need the production efficiency guy. I've got uh, inflation reduction guy. Capped on military points. General? At least one general. Wow, that guy sucks. At least got a siege pip, though. Trading coffee has come to us. We get institution spread, which is really nice. Let's keep bumping that mercantilism. Point eight morale. Golden era, Persian traditions, military drill. Holy crap. If you guys had troops, you would tear me apart. An accidental compliment. Bengal's opinion of us goes up, which is nice. They are not willing to give me this quite yet, and we're capped on military points yet again, which means probably development time. So here has it, here has it, here has it. We actually are close-ish to being able to embrace it. Only a couple thousand gold off. I knew 
where the closest one to it having been to it being embraced was. Don't really want to fire any of these generals. Well, I think we're just going to go with wherever it's cheapest to develop then. Cheapest to develop where it's going to do the most good. Here. Paton. T A N. Turn on development cost. Do that for now. I'd still take these text five years early, but. That should do it. Okay, so the people who are joining the coalition will be Persia, Tiberistan, and Sulu. And I don't think that'll cause the coalition to fire, so... I have one billion overextension now. Approximately. Only 93. But... We want to release... Afghanistan. And then... Uh, Chagai. That one. That one. Farah. Oh, I probably shouldn't have given them. I don't know how close they are going to be to 100% overextension. Let me give them this stuff up in here so I have to core this. That's fine. I mean, it's not ideal, but... Eh, they're only like 27% overextension, so I don't think it's going to be too big of an issue now. Uh, Sabazwar, that one. Ar Ar Ardican. Yeah, it helps they already had pores on like five of this. Bam. Uh, Quishtan. And that one. Sweet. Afghanistan lives, and they are huge. Tiberistan likely joining the uh, coalition and I should probably improve with Afghanistan yep can I make another 40 stack a 20 stack not quite and still a little ways off of uh, embracing the tech, embracing the uh, institution. Bengal's a little pissed. I could turn off divert, divert trade, or I could just placate. Let's placate for now, because that divert trade is making me a lot of money. Uh, turn that off. So when they get out, they're going to join the coalition as well. You're a minglet. I have a truce with you, and you'll probably join the coalition as soon as it's over. You're a minglet. Which, me, which leaves me with Ternate and Tador to deal with out over here. Uh, 
and then it's either the Ottomans or Ming or Ethiopia. I could go after like, uh, ooh, I should go after Kilwa. All this stuff. They've almost dri driven Portugal all the way out. That'd be good. What tech level are they on? 13? Oh my gosh. Oh, that'd be really good. Uh, okay. That is definitely a thought. Five years away from getting the dip tech. The, the, uh... Ooh, um... I need to look at the numbers. Alright, we force them to pay, we gain a bunch of ducats. The Brahmins gain loyalty, which is fine. The Merchant Guilds lose loyalty, which isn't great. The Mar Brahmins gain influence, which is fine. The Merchant Guilds lose influence, which is fine. Or the Brahmins can lose loyalty and influence. I could intervene against the Ottomans and Russia. The Ottomans have allied Russia? Oh my gosh. That's an unholy alliance right there. They're against Austria, Poland. I mean, I don't see them winning that even with my help. So I want to clean up these guys. There it is. Need one more heavy to finish. Turn Palawan into city for alliance. Remove Coruscant. Let's turn that into a city. Um, I am paying for my troops right now when I don't need to be. Not paying for forts. Um, let me... Oh, if you could, like, take out Tador, and then I could just do one war and eat you all up at once, that'd be great. Let me go ahead and build the spy network over here again. Capped on dip. Promote mercantilism. Should be close, right? 39.92. Uh, and then once that's done, I want to build a manufactory in my capital. And probably a few other places as well, but that's the number one place that I care about. Don't have any conversions I can do at the moment? Nope. This is still making progress, correct? Correct. Coffee boom. Price of coffee goes up. And our embracement went up because my, uh, whatchamacallit, probably went down. Do I want to spend the 4,000 ducats? I mean, I can at least hold off until... I can hold off for four years, right? I'm not taking a tech until then anyway, so... Alright, you guys... Go hunt pirates in... Go, uh...
the war look like? Uh, it's not anywhere near over yet. Sai has got some liberty desire. Bengali's tender rebels have risen up. That's fine. Sai actually has more provinces than Bengal does. Which is kind of crazy if you look at it. But here soon I'll be able to integrate one and or both of them. running out of prestige to give them. Merchant defects. Uh, give me the mercantilism. Expectations. Uh, I need my admin. Sorry. Sorry. Three years ahead of time. Can you guys win this war? Conquer Sirhind. I think that's in Jampur. Yeah. Who I don't get to touch right now. When does this end? 22 months. A little, little less than two years. Who's Kangra? Those guys? No. No. Should do that. Our air is greedy. I've got enough to where I can build this mini factory here. Oh, capped on military points. fight these guys Sean has gotten big man so how long till we get people you have a 300 aggressive expansion how about you you only have 32 aggressive expansion If I could possibly catch them where the Ottomans wouldn't uh, defend them coming in. Give me the legitimacy.
<laughs> can demand the military support. Support. I've already. I just got so much military. I didn't. I pushed the wrong button. I recruited a conquistador instead of giving, granted a general. province now. I don't have to, but I want to. They need three more percent. And they are less than 150 away from the cap, so... Take a gander. Two years. Present here. Where else is this, uh, wonder if the just maybe the Ottomans wouldn't jump in oh no it's an auto it's an auto thing okay yeah seven months truce with molten has ended Maybe if I clicked the button like before they had a chance, I could have done it, but. Lost a general. Harsh life on the ocean. Lose 4,500 sailors. It's fine. It's not great, but it's not like the worst thing that's ever happened. Get next to merchant though, and we embrace this institution, that'll be nice. And the Age of Absolutism has started. A couple years late, but it's fine. Uh, I almost have potential for a large army. Not Emperor China. I could get multicultural nation. Uh, I need to get universities for sure. Well, you know what? We're going to deal with all that on the next episode. Thank you guys so much for joining me. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to hit that like button down below, as well as subscribe to the channel, and leave me a comment. Who the heck is this? Oh, that's Poseidon? That's fine. Um, Should I jump in this war? Should I go help Austria? I mean, now that it's just these guys, definitely not. But uh, anyways, should I have done it earlier? Look at them. They are like full occupied. Anyways, once again, thank you guys so much for joining me, and I will see you next time.